what is up and welcome back to the channel. We're doing something new today. We are going to be looking at NBA 2K23. Yes, we're doing a little bit of a face cam. We haven't really done this for any NBA videos, but today we're going to do it. Um, if you guys are new to the channel, please hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Without further ado, we are going to go through my ratings for NBA 2K23. So we're going to go through the point guards, the shooting guards, more forwards, power forwards, and centers. I'm going to give you my top five ratings and what I believe they should be rated in NBA 2K. I want you guys to comment down below what you guys think. If you agree, if you don't agree, please let me know. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so let's start with the point guards and we're going to go our top five. So it's just going to be top fives. NBA 2K23 is less than a month away now. I believe it's like one day under a month. Will you guys be picking it up? Uh, the Michael Jordan uh, legend moments just got revealed yesterday. So that should be a lot of fun. I can't wait to play that. I probably will play that on the channel. We're also doing a giveaway. As you guys know at the start of the video, all you have to do is comment down below uh, who your favorite NBA player is. Just drop a comment, man. Any comment can do. You got to like, you got to comment, and you got to subscribe to the channel. Uh, we're going to try. We're actually closing in on 20K. So we're almost at 20K. We're almost there. It's going to be a lot of fun. NBA 2K23 content is going to be neck level. I'm telling you right, right now, I've got a lot of plans for NBA 2K23. So we're definitely going to get around to that. But I'm going to go through my ratings. I want to. I want debates, man. I want you guys in the comment section down below to let me know if you agree with my ratings for these players. It's only top five players from each position. Um, if you guys want to see me do like an extended version, some more NBA 2K23 updates, I can definitely do that. If you want to see some face cams, please let me know. But let's get into the video. We're going to start with point guards and we start out in Golden State. We start with Stephen Curry. Now, I've actually got Stephen Curry at a 97. I believe he should be the number one overall point guard in the game. He's coming off an MVP. I'm just going to run through these. We've got Luka at 96 at uh, second. So Luka Dontich, number two, 96. I mean, Luka and Steph, you'd probably give Luka like 96 as well. We've got Jar, our next drop. Now, this, this is a bit of a drop off. It goes from 96 down to 92. So Jar Moran, I've got him at 92. We've got Trey Young at 91. Big Trey Young, Trey, he, ice cold Trey. Now, honorable mentions for this, I did have Dane Lillard, Kyrie Irving, and Drew Holiday, but I've actually squeezed in CP3 with a 90. I just feel like CP3's point guard. Point guard, we've got to give him his respect, so I've got CP3 in there. He is a 90. Let's get over to the shooting guards. So before we go into the shooting guards, let's recap that. We've got Steph, Luca, Jar, Trey Young, and CP3. They're the order. Let me know what you guys think of that. Uh, we'll go on to the... Shooting guards, as we close out the point guard. Okay, so the shooting guards, we start out with D-Book. I've gave D-Book the highest rating uh, for a player with 95. I think D-Book took his game to a next level last year. He's actually the cover athlete for NBA 2K23. So I've got D-Book with the 94. We go to number two, James Harden, who, I mean, is he is he going to bounce back this season with the Philadelphia 76ers? I've got James Harden, 92. We've got Jalen Brown, man. Respect to Jalen Brown. I've got him at number three. I feel like Jalen Brown, he definitely needs his flowers. I've got him at 90 at, and basically tied on 89. I've got Donovan Mitchell and Bradley Bill. So they're my shooting guards. So Devin Booker, James Harden, Jalen Brown, Donovan Mitchell, Bradley Bill. Some honorable mentions in there. Now, I've already written down. So if you guys see me looking down, it's just because I've got these written down. I've got Zach Levine, Desmond Bain, and CJ McCollum. So they're my honorable mentions. My top five for shooting guards. Let me know what you guys think. We'll move on to small forwards. Okay, so small forwards, we start with the king, LeBron James. I've got LeBron James and 97 to match up with Steph. I feel like LeBron, I mean, what, he led the league in scoring last year. Can we really drop LBG, LBJ down? I don't think so. So LeBron, this is what, year 20 for LeBron? Man, crazy. Now, I've got Jimmy Butler. Now, you could probably consider Jimmy Butler a small forward, a shooting guard, but I've got him down as a small forward. So, I've got Jimmy Butler as a 94, tied with Kawhi Leonard, who's also a 94 on my list. Please let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think. We've got Paul George, a 93, and then fifth, we've got Jason Tatum with a 92. Some people might say that Jason Tatum should be higher. My honorable mentions, I've got Brandon Ingram, I've got DeMar DeRozan, and I know Anthony Edwards is a shooting guard, but I've actually thrown him in with the small forwards. I feel like we need to give him a shout out. So my top five for small forwards, I've got LeBron James, Jimmy Butler, Kawhi Leonard, Paul George, and Jason Tatum. Now, Jason Tatum did struggle in the finals. I've still got him at 92. Definitely work his way up. I feel like you can't be giving everyone high ratings. I feel like you need to drop them down. There needs to be like a little bit of a level. 
So I feel like LeBron with the 97, Steph with the 97, your big players with 97s is how it's going to work. We'll go on to the power forwards. Okay, so we move on to power forwards. Now, I don't know if you can really classify Kevin Durant as a power forward, but I've put him in there. So I've got him and Giannis on 97. And then there's a big drop. Now, I mean, there's, there's only a big drop because this man has been injured quite a lot recently. And that is Anthony Davis. I've got Anthony Davis 91. And i got a surprise packet in there. I've got Jackson Jr. And I've had to throw Zion in there as well. 89 and 89, both tied. I know it's probably a little bit biased. Zion hasn't played for an entire year. But I've got Zion in there. And my honorable mentions, I've got uh, Siakam. I've got Sabonis. And I've got Draymond Green. So they're my top five for the power forward. I've got Giannis, Durant, AD, Zion. So LeBron, Curry, Giannis, and Durant are the highest rated players in the game so far that I've got. At a 97, as we move on to the centers. And we start with Nikola Jokic, the reigning MVP. I've got him a 97 as well. So no one's a clear cut. I was going to put Giannis 98. I kind of feel like Giannis could have been 98. I've got Joel Embiid 96. He's second. Carl Anthony Towns a 91. Rudy Gobert 90. And Bam an 88. And I've also got DeAndre Ayton as an 88. So it was like a top six for the centers. But they're my centers. You've got Jokic, Embiid, Cat, Gobert, and Bam. Please let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think of my top five rated players from each position. Uh, was there anything you would change? I mean, your point guards, when you go rewind, pause video and go back and have a look, do that. But uh, yeah, man, we're one, I think we're like maybe a month away from NBA 2K23. And like I said, we are doing a giveaway, so I can't wait to get that out to you guys. I can't wait to uh, really get that 2K23 rolling. I've got game five dropping in, an, I think tomorrow maybe, game five's dropping of the My Career Series. So make sure to go check that out. Hope you guys are having a really nice day. Please let me know in the comment section down below what you guys thought of my ratings. And without further ado, stay blessed. I'll see you guys in the